Up in Mount Vernon, New York, not too far from New York City, the mayor up there had a great idea. Let's take one of the new rappers, one of the kids like to listen to, Fat Boy, Fat Boy SSE. Let's bring him to Mount, new- Mount Vernon. Let's make him mayor for the day. Let's give the fellas and their lovely ladies something to look up to because he's popular with the kids. Let's take him to a black school. Let's give the kids something to look up to. Let's get them excited. Let's see what they do. And I don't like bullying because it's not it's not cool. Internet star Fatboy SSE, who has more than 5 million followers on Instagram, says his intentions for visiting Mount Vernon High School on Friday were positive and meant to inspire students. But the school district says the unannounced and unauthorized visit orchestrated by Mayor Richard Thomas created complete chaos. Fights broke out as hundreds of students tried to get a glimpse of the rapper and comedian. I started viewing some of his messages. Messaging. He's not the kind of, that's not the kind of image I want our students to be uh, e- exposed to. A trophy case was shattered, a glass door broken, and one student was even arrested. Several others were suspended. The mayor says he brought Fatboy to Mount Vernon to bring publicity to the city and even made him mayor for the day. But when asked if it was irresponsible to show up to the high school unannounced. I don't believe that the word irresponsible fits. What I know is we follow the process as close as possible. As for the mayor, melee that ensued. The mayor claims he had no idea it ever happened until Sunday, only saying this. You know, the kids were smiling. Everybody was 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 happy. Um, There was one skirmish when we, you know, kind of was about to leave. But he went out into the crowd and said, wait a minute, no fighting. But the school district is now seeking legal action against both the mayor and fat boy. We're going to try to get all the money that he owes us. We have a lot of broken doors, broken windows. If there are any damages, we'll definitely make sure it gets taken care of. The trustees also passed a resolution requiring Mayor Thomas to receive approval before going to any school. Now, Vernon School District speaking out after video surfaced of students seemingly out of control and fighting in the the school less than a week after a riot ensued. News 12's Richard Giacobis has the story. We don't have fights every day at Mount Vernon High School. But when you look at video after video showing brawl after brawl, the principal of Mount Vernon High School, Ronald Gonzalez, says he thinks he knows how fights like this start. When those routines are broken, students can sometimes revert back to either behaviors that they've practiced in the past or revert to behaviors that they may not that may not be normal for them. Those routines for over 1,600 students were in fact broken last Friday when Mayor Richard Thomas brought high-profile rapper Fatboy to the high school during exam time, unannounced. It was not normal for our students to have their uh, exams interrupted and so they're responding in an, in an atypical way. It wasn't a typical day at Mount Vernon High School. Which the principal feels may have led to this out of control behavior caught on video and why the school board decided to take legal action against the mayor asking the city to pay for the damage left behind at the school following last Friday's visit. It was really just about making sure that we're back to normal next period. Now the principal says there are over 1,600 students in the high school alone and he says policing all of those students and getting them back on track take some time, but he says he feels they are back on track, and he's hoping that the students who posted those videos of the fights on social media, that they take them down. This is News 12 Nightside. I'm Rich Barabi. The mayor of Mount Vernon barred from entering area schools without the superintendent's permission. This after the mayor brought a rapper into Mount Vernon High School on Friday, and chaos ensued. Nightside's Kayla Ayers has the story. Rapper Fatboy SSE's surprise visit with Mayor Richard Thomas to Mount Vernon High School on Friday, all documented on social media. I came from the block eating oodles and noodles. Now when you see me, you can Google. The rapper, with a social media following in the millions, was touring the city as the honorary mayor for the day. We're on our way to the high school. I appreciate y'all for having me. Video clips from the school showing the rapper with cash, students chasing him, and the visit seemingly spiraling out of control. People in the city unsurprised how things turned out. You can't bring a rapper to school unannounced in front of a bunch of impressionable children and not expect them to go crazy. Mount Vernon police confirming school resource officers stepped in to restore order. 
District spokesperson saying there was some damage to the school and that the mayor will need express permission from the superintendent in order to visit a school. In a statement, Superintendent Kenneth Hamilton saying, quote, I am hopeful that Mayor Thomas will acknowledge his error in judgment, issue an apology, and accept full responsibility for any fallout from this event. I am sure Mayor Thomas had good intentions, but this impromptu visit with Fat Boy was anything but good, particularly during midterms, which had to be rescheduled. The mayor's office hasn't responded to News 12's request for comment, but Tyreek Kimbrough, known professionally as Fat Boy SSE, says he was just trying to show the students love and didn't realize he interrupted exams. I didn't know they were taking midterms, like, you know, but I want them to pass the midterms. They are to pass the midterms. The midterms. But he says, in hindsight, he wouldn't change anything. I was the mayor for the day of Mount Vernon, uh, city of Mount Vernon, so it could have been handled different. Please, sir, I want some more. I love that guy who was talking about, that's not the messaging we particularly like for our students. Well, if you go to Google or, or DuckDuckGo and you type in Fat Boy and his f biggest songs, you'll get a list of his songs, look up some of the lyrics. Most of the songs are about the same thing. Guns, drugs, money, bitches. Guns, drugs, money, bitches, gangs. Guns, drugs, money, bitches, gangs. And uh, lots of pretty vivid descriptions of what he does with the lovely ladies, what he does with drugs, what he does with people he don't like, that kind of stuff. <laughs> oh, man. You know, every time we get to one of these stories, every story we do here, it's like, I can't believe that happened. Did that really happen? That didn't happen, did it? The answer is always yes. The answer is always, how could that be? The answer is always, don't they have anything in mind except not making the black kids angry? <laughs>